Hello everyone, welcome in to Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah Presents Vlogtober slash Crochettober 2021 and um, it's the 27th. Oh my gosh, it's almost over. Had to pull out some of my uh, Halloween shirts that I've got. Yes, this is sparkly and glittery with little sequins. Got this at Walmart like years ago on the after time markdown because I'm all about the sale. So yeah. Also today, uh, busted out the sparkly spiderweb earrings again because I really, really like them. And uh, some vaguely purple lipstick. Because why not? I mean, I'll do that anytime. Not just Halloween. <laughs> now, huh, it has been busy with work. Yeah. Oh, you've already got a project you need to do? Here's another one. Oh, we're not gonna give you any extra time to do it either. Thanks, y'all. Welcome to my world. Uh, some folks were asking and hoping that the car got fixed. It did. Um, after Sean was able to get that uh, fuse box, I don't know what this was all about, fuse box do doohickey out of it, um, he and the hubby worked together to get all the fuses lined up and put in the right one and everything. And then they were able to get it installed. It is working A-OK. -okay fine and dandy and yeah hopefully I'll continue to have brake lights for a while because yeah you, you need brake lights to drive you got to be safe okay you just do so have you taken a look at my 500 subscriber giveaway video yet you need to you need to watch it all the way to the end make sure you pay attention to what I'm asking you because I'm asking you something specific. It's not difficult or anything. I'm not asking you to do like, you know, calculus or algebra or anything like that or whatever. But uh, I'm just asking you a question that you have to answer and to do a couple of little tiny things, which I'm pretty sure that most of y'all are doing anyway. Really. You comment, you like, you're subscribed. If you're not subscribed, please do so and make sure that your subscriptions are public because when I draw, I have to be able to see that you are a public subscriber. And if you're not, I have to eh, and go to the next person and you would not want to miss out because in addition to the things I've shown, I did add something to my community tab that I was adding to the giveaway because I forgot to put in there and you never know what else might pop in there that I can shove in a box. So yes, I do like to do that. I have finished today's round on my crochet tober blanket oh my gosh I get an hour for a lunch break and I had already eaten my lunch at breakfast time which is like my first break time which was 10 o'clock my lunch comes around at noon and I just come run in and sit down and start crocheting you know and I got most of the way around except for like this far and then in my afternoon break I get a 15 minute break in the afternoon as well I jumped in there and uh finished it up so and then did like three stitches on my pick and mix cow <laughs> I am putting my time to maximum use okay as best as I can this is it today I have not woven in my ends in a couple of days I will get to that holy cannoli y'all look at how big this is it is amazing Yes, and I know, but not they're not too bad. I don't have like the whole blankets worth or anything, just a few days. Today, I added that bright orange again because I realized I hadn't used it in a while. And I kind of like it. It's, it's kind of festive and Halloween-y. Halloween-y? Is that a word? Well, it is now. Okay, it's Halloween-y. And um, yeah, I thought it would go nice up against that really dark blue that was there. I did take my other nail polish off. I've got to put my glow in the dark ones on. I'm running out of time because Saturday I will be going to Mad World and I have to have something I can see in front of my face on the dark parts of the haunted house. Yes, I am so looking forward to it. Uh, but yeah, this is getting really huge. It will not end up as big as my bed. I've got a king size bed, but it will look really cool laying on top of my dark purple comforter that I have on there. Just bloom right on top of it, right? Yeah, I'm kind of digging it. I'm so glad I got asked to take part. If you want to take part, you know what? Next year. Oh, yes. Next year, there will be a new tag. It'll say Crochet Tober 2022 because that's what we're going to do. Sorry, losing my draws. You don't want to do that. Um, what have you been working on? 
it's only Wednesday. It feels like it should be Friday five times over already because it has been so crazy busy for me. But um, yeah, hopefully you have got uh, some good crochet things going on. A lot of giveaways floating around. If I happen to notice some that maybe may not be on one of the, you know, like not on Crystal Bag of Days channel because she, you know, everybody sees her giveaways. I'm going to post that kind of stuff in my community tab because you don't want to miss out. It's going to be fun. This crochet community is a fun community. It's a caring community. And uh, yeah, I will have a mini haul coming out tomorrow morning or late tonight, early tomorrow, you know, yada, yada, whatever. There is another tutorial coming out. I did just have a flip through of the Crochet World magazine. Yeah, it's kind of a long thing and I'm showing you pictures and stuff. If you don't get the magazine, you may want to take a look because you may decide that you want to go search it out if there's something in there you really like. Yeah. Also, next week, I'm going to have a look through of the All Recipes magazine that just came out with a hint, hint, possible giveaway in it as well. So pay attention to that one too. Thanks for coming by. I do appreciate you. I appreciate everybody leaving me comments and I know that sometimes I don't get back to my comments as quickly as I should. It's just a lot to keep up with when you work a full-time job, but I will do it. So thank you for coming by and enjoying the craziness that is me, my life, you know, crochet life and stuff. Sometimes it's just stuff. I don't know how stuff wouldn't be part of life, but hey, that's what I came up with. So there we are. Oscar is napping. Do you want to see Oscar? I thought you might. Let me pause it. He was napping. I woke him up. But he's so sweet most of the time. Except when you saw him chomping me because he wanted to chomp that pink pumpkin. Right, Munch? Oscar. Show them your pretty eyeliner, sweet boy. Yeah. Anyway, me and my teeny baby are signing off for the evening. <laughs> yes, much. Mama loves you. And uh, hopefully you'll come back again tomorrow. Bye, y'all.